Hello everyone, it's Troy here from Tennis Warehouse, back again for this week's vlog. More new product, it's 2024, the Australian Open's on TV, and we got some more rackets for you. Um, very popular line from Head, most of you know about the Head Speeds. These are the 2024 versions, or uh, we call them Auxetic 2.0, which is the technology update. I'm going to jump into the, uh, the different models here and start off with uh, the more user-friendly, easy-to-use rackets in the line and get into the more control stuff. So first one here is the new Head Speed Team. It's got the Auxetic 2.0, which uh, basically the addition of uh, the uh, Auxetic technology in the hoop and the uh, yoke region here. So what we're noticing with that update technology, as we saw with the Prestiges, is just a very soft, plush feel, getting back to that, that classic uh, head flexibility and comfort. So this speed team here, really user-friendly. This is a 105. So those of you out there that are kind of weary about jumping into the speeds, they want you know maybe a little more user-friendliness, kind of that uh, intermediate level player, or maybe even just a, an older player looking for the bigger head size, this 105 is a good one to check out. Um, it's a, a 270 gram unstrung frame, and some of our strung specs are right around 10 ounces strung with the string, about three points head light, a really maneuverable, uh, about 306 swing weight, and a 61 stiffness here, so very flexible, very comfortable, and uh, just easy to use from uh, all areas of the court. The next one is the lighter version of the MP, so this is the MPL. Um, the regular MP is 300 gram frame, this is a 280, so those players that want to try the uh, MP but want something a little faster, um, or the you know upcoming you know kind of junior player that wants that control from the MP but easier to swing, this is a great option. This one's about 10-4 strong, about three points head light, 313 average swing weight, 60 stiffness. So those junior players out there uh, looking for comfort on the arm, this is a great one. And then these two have been in the line. Very popular, endorsed on the Pro Tour. This MP here, this is the uh, Speed MP as well as the Pro. Uh, we'll talk about the MP endorsed by Yannick Sinner. 300 grams, 100 square inch hoop, 16, 19 pattern. This one's a uh, 11 1 here, strong, about four points head light, a nice solid 330 average swing weight and 60 stiffness, so very comfortable. We got reviews on the MP and the Pro on our YouTube, check those out right now. Um, next one, the Pro. This one's endorsed on the tour by the one and only Novak Djokovic. 11.6 uh, ounces strung or a 310 gram unstrung. Six headlight, about a 333 swing weight and a 60 RA. Very comfortable, very plush. I was on the review for this. This is a great, versatile, modern player's racket. Good from all areas of the court. So those are the speeds. Auxetic 2.0. Let's jump into our next rackets. The CX series from Dunlop. Gets an update. Gets a facelift. We'll talk about some of the technologies here real quick. Um, one of them is the Vibra Shield. So it's a dampening technology in combination with their uh, Sonic Core, which they've already, already had. But the Vibra Shield's up in the hoop as well as down here in the yoke area. Really comfortable, really plush. A couple other tweaks they've made. They made a sharper box beam on this, so that classic control uh, type of feel there. Um, and then also something I'm really looking forward to on the string bed. On the previous line, it was really tight in the center and more open around the perimeter. With this one, it's just more evenly spaced, more open, more spin friendly, and a more predictable response. So I'm really looking forward to that when I try out these rackets for play testing. Um, but this model here is the CX200. So sort of that classic control box beam, but with a bigger oversize or closer to oversize 105 head size. So a user friendly one here, classic feel, forgiveness from the hoop. Um, specs are about 10.9 ounces strong, about three points head light, a, three th a 319 swing weight and 63 comfortable flexibility. That's the 200 oversize. Next up, we have the 400 series. So in the CX line, the 400s are a little bit thicker than the 200s, also a little bit stiffer. So these are a little bit easier power, although they still retain that box shape for that classic feel. So the 400 uh, is right here, the CX 400. And uh, this one, the specs are about 10.6 strong, about two points headlight, 313 on the swing weight, and 69 stiffness. So this is the stiffest of the bunch, easiest energy return. And then we have the 400 Tour, which is a little heavier. So 11.2 ounces strong, 
four headlight, about 317 swing weight, 66 on the stiffness here. So just a little bit more solid, heavier version of the 400, 400 Tour. And then last but not least, we're gonna finish off with the 200 rackets. The 200s have been in Dunlop's family for a long time, going way back to like McEnroe days. I started off with the 200 with the m -fill, so really uh, familiar with the Dunlop CX 200 rackets. This, uh, this 200 right here has a 98 head size, 1619 pattern. The specs on it, 11.4 strung, seven points headlight, 314 on the swing weight, and about 64 stiffness. And then the last two are the 200 tours. These are the most control, 95 head sizes. We have a 1619 here with a synthetic grip, 1820 with a leather grip, and the uh, 1619, a little bit more spin, uh, space in the string pattern. This one specs are about 11.5, seven points headlight, a 314 swing weight, and a mid 60 on the stiffness. And then for the 1820, we don't have the strung specs quite yet on the website, but I'll give you the unstrung target. 315 gram unstrung frame, about 10 head light. So that'll drop down a couple points with the string. 65 RA stiffness, that'll drop a little bit with the string. And then in the past, the swing weight's pretty maneuverable on these, usually in that like 310 to 315 range. So that's all I have for you this week on the vlog. See you next week.